Well, Ty, a split on the weekend uh, on home ice for the Manitoba Moose. Uh, how did you see things? Uh, we played good uh, first game. Um, you know, we it was a tight game the whole way. Uh, and we found a way to get the lead in the third period and win the game. Um, second game wasn't the best of games for us. Uh, we got off to a slow start and, uh, you know, we had some spurts throughout the game that uh, we looked sharp, but uh, we just didn't have a full 60-minute game to come away with the two points there. You're one of the guys who knows so exactly what I'm talking about, a new guy here getting used to a new system and some new teammates. How difficult is that? Yeah, it's tough. Um, you know, just figuring out your surroundings and everything and uh, new systems, um, especially I think there's 15 or something new guys. Uh, so, just, so just trying to find your way, see what uh, you can bring uh, that will help the team win. Um, it's definitely going to take some time just with all the new faces. Um, but, you know, you can definitely see the talent throughout the dressing room and uh, through the game. Um, you see spurts of uh, what the guys are here to do. And um, I think uh, it's going to take a little bit, but uh, we're working real hard in practice throughout the weeks, and uh, it's going to come. Well, you talked about practice today, uh, another one of those practices like last week where there was a real focus, a real determination to the group. Uh, and it seems like there's a, an intensity there. This team wants to get together fast and, and start to produce some results. Yeah, that's the the best thing to uh, bring guys together and the team together is it starts in practice. And, you know, our coaches are really uh, working us hard and, you know, you have to embrace it as a uh, pr uh, professional athlete. Um, you know, I think everybody in here uh, knows we have a lot of uh, a lot of weaknesses in our game right now that we need to improve on and the only way we're going to improve on it and become a winning uh, team and um, organization that uh, it starts in practice and working hard there. This weekend, a special weekend for the McGinn family. Uh, your folks were in town, uh, grandparents too. Uh, you had games and your brother came in with the Carolina Hurricanes, a little brother, Brock. Uh, what was that like to get together in this type of an environment? It was awesome. Uh, it was what you call a dream, uh, dream weekend for my parents. Uh, we, they saw our games uh, Friday, Saturday, and then Brock last night on Sunday. Um, it was a lot of fun. We got to have brunch, uh, a little pregame meal for Brock on Sunday uh, afternoon. Um, and, you know, it's always fun just to see my little brother. Um, you know, my older brother plays as well, and I always enjoy seeing him when I can on the road. Uh, we spend so much time in the summertime together. Um, that uh, you definitely get missing them throughout the long, long winter. So when you get to see them for short spurts uh, throughout the hockey season, uh, it's always good. When you're employed by the Jets organization, is it the best of everything when it's a heck of a game and the Jets end up winning when a tight one? Yeah, it was good. It was, uh, it was a great game, I thought. Um, both teams were real good. Um, Carolina looked uh, real fast, uh, a real young team, and they looked determined out there. Um, it was good to see Winnipeg come out with the win. Uh, you know, I thought it could have went either way at some points, but uh, you know, that's that's the game of hockey, and Winnipeg came out on top. It was good.